G'day, how are you going? My name's Mark and the purpose of this video is just to allow you to check out the blue screen behind me and so that I can give you a bit of simple tuition on how I get the surroundings that I do. Pretty straightforward really, but you know what? <laughs> the easiest way will be for me to come over and pick up that camera and um, show you just how simple and basic this is. So that's what I'll do, and then I'll pop it back. Hang on a second. Check it out. Look. This is my shed. Fish tank. A sheet. Pegged up next to the roller door. As you can see, look, there's a light down there, sitting on a chair. I swizzle around here. There's another light there. Uh, there's a ladder, that was what the camera was sitting on. And right up above me, there's another light that's hanging from the ceiling. So that's basically the situation. Now I'll pop it back. Remember, we're doing this in one take. So as you can see, just how simple and straightforward it can be. That's the blue sheet. Ready? There you go. We changed it. Background can be still, or it can be moving. All you need is the blue screen um, formula blue screen transition for Windows Movie Maker and you're away. At the bottom of this video, just down there, can you see me? <laughs> Where I'm pointing? Just down there. I'm putting a um, response, a video response, which is another one of my videos that actually explains exactly how to go about this. Right there, guys. Thanks for watching, eh? I hope you use blue screen in some of your videos and I really look forward to uh, you adding your video edit as a video response to mine so that I can get to check out how you use the blue screen for your videos. It doesn't matter what business you're in, if you're in any business, or even if you're just doing this for a hobby. I'd just be really keen to see how you go. Right, cheers, eh? Bye-bye.